problem is, <clears throat> in this area the internet connection is just horrible. So when I was going live earlier, I just cut out. But that's why I'm gonna go ahead and just do a regular non-live stream, if you will. A delayed stream. So, you can see, <clears throat> I just left Katalung, I'm headed for Suratani. <clears throat> Suratani, of course, is the area in Thailand connecting most of the islands to the mainland. From there the ferries go to Koh Samui, uh, Koh Phangan, where the annual, when your monthly full moon party was happening until COVID-19 hits. But now you see, actually Thailand is recovering, the nature is recovering, but nature always wins in Thailand. But now that the tourists are gone, it seems that, uh, wow, it's absolutely amazing, you know what I mean? And it's funny how in this life, people look at nature like a rarity. Like you have to pay to go to a national park. Nature is like a zoo. You know, you know what I mean? Nature is like a cinema. Like you want to go to the movie cinema or you want to go to a nightclub or you want to see nature. But you got to pay to see nature here. Like you are a guest of nature. You know what I mean? And that's what I absolutely love. And there's of course, you know, um, the train running through. But what is the train compared to the amazingness? of the nature that's surrounding the tracks. So this is one of those things that I absolutely think is, you know, the best of both worlds. You have the non-destructive intrusion that you as a person sort of manifest and then whatever's around it.